and girls, welcome to another page in God's Great Book of Nature. Today, we're going to learn about a hole's housing. I'm sorry, a what? A hole's housing. What's a hole's housing? Well, a hole's housing is a wood pile that has been stacked in a circular shape, like the one behind me. It's also called the beehive stack or a round stack because of the shape that it has. This kind of wood pile is stacked very carefully and you don't need a shed or a rack or anything to hold the wood in place. You simply start by sticking a branch in the ground and then you lay wood logs all around it. You keep piling and stacking up from there. Once you have a good little round wall, you start filling in the center with more logs. You can store a lot of firewood in a small space this way. The whole thing is really strong and secure. It can stand against tough winds and rain. Do you know what happens to a piece of wood if it's left on the ground by itself? Well, it gets rained on, soggy, and eaten by worms. It also starts rotting away. Yikes! But if this piece of wood gets stacked in a pile with other wood, with time, the sun and fresh air will dry it out and it will be ready to be used as firewood. Now that's more like it. God didn't make us to be alone like that rotting log. Left to deal with the struggles of life by ourselves, we would rot away in our sins. Instead, he made us to be in a relationship like families and church families. If we unite in a circle of truth in Jesus, we'll find that God's sunshine, which is his love, will evaporate all our sins and bad characters. His fresh air, which is the Holy Spirit, will prepare us to light a spiritual fire as we share God's love and do God's will. 1 Corinthians 12.27 says, You are the body of Christ. Each one of you is a part of it. So remember, just like this wood is piled together in a circle, making it strong and dry so it can be used as firewood, let's stand together in truth so Jesus can work on us and make us who he wants us to be. Music